I became interested in circuit steam when I was 12 years old. I was getting into some trouble at the time and I knew that I wanted a different outlet and I didn't want to go down the path of like drugs and gangs and whatever is in the neighborhood. I found out about circus theme through my mom. She told me like, hey, you should go and join the circus. And I said, nope, I don't want to be a clown. So then I denied it for a while. Um, but then later on, I decided, okay, why don't I give this circus a chance? I started juggling, I started tumbling, I started learning all these things that I wanted to do in the tumbling world. But then I also learned so much more, which made me stick to with the circus. I think Circus Team itself creates a really unique community. It encourages diversity. We have kids from all over the place. We're dealing with kids who have are making transitions in their life, coming from another country, sometimes don't speak English. There's different languages that are spoken here. So it's just so great to be exposed to those and to learn from those children and to be able to support them as they're making their transition here. Sorry I'm not perfect on my bones I'll show her what you wanted from me What you wanted from me Sorry I'm not perfect on my bones My name is Prado Kimmy, and I've been in the circus team for about 12 years now. Jackson and Ben, they're like brothers to me. We've developed a great brotherhood over the years. They've been there for me, I've been there for them. We've helped push each other to do better things. Um, we challenge each other to uh, just increase our skill level in circus or just get better grades in school, things like that. Actually, everyone on the circus team is my friend. They're wonderful people. I mean, we can just sit and talk about anything and I wouldn't feel uncomfortable. Like, they're like my second home, my second family. I think the main skill that I want the graduates of circus team to leave the program with would be confidence. Because I feel like confidence takes you so far in life and I could not tell you the perks that I've gotten out of being a confident person and um, it just I'm, I'm a really big fan of quotes and so it always makes me think of a closed mouth doesn't get fed and so sometimes all you have to do is have the confidence to ask for help or ask for this and then you get those things I mean I just came into the program so I'm kind of seeing like seeing changes that I want to make happen and seeing the exact outcomes that I want them to do. We do a lot more than circus here for sure. I'm inspired by it every day. Thank you.